making his way down to the ring. And he does so with a... Locks that belt line well. Yeah! Good work! Rusher is doing well here with that two-punch combination. Halfway through round number one. was something special. Oh, good defense there. That was a fine block by Crusher. He gets hit, but he gives it right back. There's the combo downstairs. A shooting right hand by Crusher. Keep it up. Keep it up. That's it. Nice workout. Keep fighting smart. Keep busy. Don't take a break with it. Don't fight this fight. Jump and move. underway bad intentions is hit to the head there he goes with the right hand again right to the belt line rusher's defense is it ever good Look at how easy he's able to block those punches. Zoning in on that gut combination punch downstairs. Yeah, that's it. Crusher's jacked by an uppercut. Nice at his best. When the combinations are landing, he scored well there with that combo. Covers up nicely, gets rid of his opponent's body shot. Oh, what an uppercut. Good job! He took a shot. But he came back with a right hand of his own. He had his eyes set on the uppercut, but was unable to land it. Good way to protect the midsection. a moment here as you see the step back counter punch where you realize this is the sweet science not just some raw savagery swinging out there look at the little subtleties here joe what he does is he forces him into a position to stop the punch and then when he stops able to cover up along the belt line blocks that one nice. gets rid of that it was intended for his head
early on in this fight, one of the things I'm going to look for is who's the more well-rounded fighter offensively? Who can do it all with all their punches? Well, you look for that in any sport, in any profession. You know, you look punches, at a quarterback, you know, in football, the great ones, they control deep, but they control the short patterns. They control the out, the in patterns. Same thing with a fighter. Keeps his hands up defensively, protecting the head. Good, solid right hand by bad intentions. And right from the start, he's throwing the power punches and landing them. I think he has a date and he wants to get to it. Each man able to land an uppercut. Nice work. Keep your head moving. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. Good job. It was sudden, it was fast, it was direct by bad intentions. And that's the end of round three. The beginning of round four, a chance to look at the scorecards, and Teddy, you like what he's done so far early, a clean sweep of all three rounds. Yeah, a couple of the rounds were close, but on the inside, when both of them had their chance to separate a little bit, he was the one who made the right decision to punch. Stay away from those. Missed the body shot. Russia's impressing the judges and himself with that right hand. That's a serious power punch he just landed to the head. Crusher's showing you that sublime skill right now with that two-punch combo. Good combination punching out of him here. Yeah, exactly. It's kind of like a musical, except right now I don't think his opponent likes the tone of it. He gives as well as he takes. You saw it on that exchange. Keep it up. 90 seconds to go here in this round. A clean, crisp right hand by Crusher. And now committing to that midsection as the target with the combination punch. Bad Intentions has got a way of just getting away from that punch. Very nice work to the head. The right hand landed. down the final moments of this round. Well, as that round comes to an end, he committing to the body work now, he lands the right hand. Good combination to the body. Trying to go downstairs, but off target. Goes up top with a right hand. Come on, brother, brother. There's the combo to the body. He takes a shot and then commits to giving one right back. Basic boxing, and it works so well. Put your punches together, a good combo by bad intentions. Flush right hand to the head. Well, I think a lot of people probably didn't expect this out of him, but I like the way he looks on the outside. He's an inside man, but guess what? He's got an outside touch. Good. 
comes right back at him with a left hand. And that's what fighters do. Pulls the trigger right away after taking one. Nice punch. Didn't come close. He digs in, trying to bank away body shots with the combo. Punch! Punch! And he comes right back with a headshot. Back and forth exchange. Could this be the start of a big comeback? He went from owning this fight to now nearly down and out. You know, that's what makes boxing so great. Yeah, you can come back just like Big shot there. That is a big, big punch that just put him down. And right now he's thinking about whether or not he wants to do this as a living. He gets up after that punch put him down on the canvas. Now he needs to get on that bicycle and stay away from this guy. Bad attentions, his defense is paying off now. And now another left. One, two, one, two. Good step back, counter punch there. Beautiful. He's got those earmuffs on, he's got his hands tight against his body, but Teddy, still, some things are getting through. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of like driving a car, Joe, you know, and the, the weather's a little bad, and you say, I, I want to be safe here, I'm going to stop the car. You don't stop and park the car in the middle of the highway. The cars are coming. I mean, he stopped right there in the middle of the highway. Cars are coming. You know, pull off somewhere. You know, get the heck out of there. Find the right parking spot. Bad intentions. But I mean, that's more of what he's trying to accomplish in this fight. Down on the scorecards, but now things headed in a better direction for him. Yeah, to me, he was cooperating with his opponent before. Right now, he's arguing with him. Hey, arguing is good in boxing. Rusher's jab can do so much there. He used it well that time. Nice defense did a good job there, able to avoid that punch. Digging in with uppercuts. Bad intentions is flat footed. There's no other way to describe it. He's not a fighter that gets up on his toes, moves around, gives you angles. He's flat footed. Yeah, you don't have to be on your tricycle all over the place, but you can step a little bit. Get out of range. He's doing nothing. Knight's punch is far off the target. Get him, get him. He's A little head hunting with the right. Oh! He is leveled! How could he possibly get up from that? He's not going to! This fight's over! It's over! So that's all it took, one good shot. Bad attention is correct.